Well, there's a couple of schools of thought about whether you leave your depth sounder on or not when you're fishing. I, I definitely always leave mine on because you actually see uh, the schools of Mulloway and Kingfish come through when you're anchored up. Let you know if the water temperature changes, 23.4 degrees at the moment. And the big thing is it'll let us know whether we, we actually slide off the anchor in the dark because once it gets dark, you really don't know whether you've, you've moved or not. You can actually set a, an alarm that'll tell you if you move off your spot. But if you just keep an eye on the page there, you can see at the moment we're just spinning around and around, just moving around with the swell a little bit and just and just uh, staying right exactly where we need to be. But I'll be keeping a bit of a look as it gets darker back at that sounder and, uh, and uh, looking for any of those red arches that come through and hopefully it's a mulloway or a big king. <laughs> Must be from my marlin fishing oh, day. Yep. On, on, on. You're on? Go, mate. Oh, I, just, I love that sound of that line clip. Oh, I lost him. Oh, did you? Yep. Coming out gone. of the outrigger, so just had that clip go snap on the wivy, and oh, up comes the fish. Let's see what we got here. Woohoohoo! Nice little mulloway. So that's what we were chasing. Just run the net under there for us. Yeah, little one. But yeah. He's a <laughs> Mate, that's a nice start, isn't it? Awesome. And I think we just lost a better one there. Oh, we did? Yeah. Got a bite on that other one at the same time. And look, that's what. Look, that's what happens uh, when you're, you're fishing for fish like this. They move in and around in schools, and um, I'll just pop that. So that circle hook has absolutely done its job. Perfectly in the corner of the jaw, straight out. And uh, there we go. <laughs> he's, a, he's a cracking little Jewy. He is a beauty. But um, this time of year, you just don't know whether you're gonna get a, a big one, a small one, an in-between one, but any mulloway you catch is fantastic. So. Mate, it was all happening there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I had one crack out of the rigger here and the other one pulled out of the rigger as well there. Yeah, that seems like a better fish that other one. Oh, but... okay. Oh, well. You felt a bit of weight on it? Or? Yeah, it yeah cool. okay. Bit of bad luck there, mate, but he's a nice fish. And look, he's uh, he's good. We're in a bit of, it's, you know, reasonable depth of water here, but that fish will certainly swim away. All right, so let's get him back in the water. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Little pinch on the tail and he's rocketed back to the bottom and uh, Mate, he can live and play and get a bit bigger another day, that bloke.